by something that's gonna kill them. I've run the hell away from a town like this. Uh. Isn't somebody gonna miss those hooks? Not as much as they're gonna miss us. You're gonna make me cry, girl. Hmm. Hey, maidens, I'm going to kill Mog Chakra. I'm already killing it in this outfit. Just stand in here. And don't you guys Thanks, Josh, for telling me that you're playing speedrunners. To save the town, I mean. Um, this is how it's always been done. Yeah, they figured out how to do it a long time ago, so we wouldn't have to think about it. <sighs> you made me nervous. Yeah. Nervous that Marshall June isn't gonna get the offering arena ready before Mob Chopper gets here. Oh, I can't believe our dad's donated so much to his campaign. How about just one little squirt? Sorry. If I'm not gonna give any to my best friend, Drusilla, I'm certainly not gonna give any to you. I said I don't want any. I don't use performance enhancers. See you ladies later. So... If I had to guess, I'm gonna have to steal your stuff. In 20 years, they will be using it. But, uh, yeah, you're right, bro. Oh my god! These seagulls seem to really like fish guts. Looking at this chum trough makes me really happy I grew up in a baking town instead of a fishing town. I just hope my baking town is still standing. Oh my god, so much graphic. <laughs> These fishing poles are useless. All the hooks have been stolen. Oh, driftwood. So smooth. So, what am I going to use driftwood for? So I guess I might as well explore, because that's pretty much my main thing I have to do. Oh. Guardians. What? Oh, so you're going to... So, who are you two? I am Dead Eye Dawn, and this is Dead Hi. <laughs> what is this place? What is this place? The Dead Eye Pyramid. Tomb of the Dead Eye God. As if you didn't know. Because I'm not around from around here, dicks. You wish to invade our holiest of shrines? Why? I don't know. <laughs> it just looks cool. <laughs> Look at her face. It's like I don't wait. Fuck you, bitch. Look at you. <laughs> Look at, Look at, I don't know really if I'm being completely honest or because you guys are guarding it, so it must be cool. Oh, it is extremely cool. But no one enters the Dead Eye Pyramid. No one. Well, Not even you? Unless. What? Well, that sounds like Illuminati. If she could solve the riddle of yarn. Oh, yeah. If she could solve that, then she'd definitely be worthy. No problem. Alright, so. How does it go? Could you remind me how the riddle of yarn goes one more time? You always take us down when we are in our prime. Devour your sweet rewards, yet I'll return in time. My chakra? A child of mine will rise out of his rotten bed. Up from a hidden pit. He gives some good I am dead. Um. Well. Oh. Yeah. Bring us a solution, and you may enter the pyramid. Driftward? Or something? Who's the dead eye god? The Messiah from the sky. Bringer of miracle objects. Uh oh. Oh, so you're talking about Cloud Central? And begin the battle of Volgantol. That sounds cool. Did your god bring any miracle objects that were like 
Weapons? The kind that can take down a giant monster before it destroys your home village? Our god had such power and more. Probably. <laughs> we don't even know what half the stuff in there does. So you're guarding something cool, but you don't really know what it is, and yet you're worshipping a god who brought stuff from the sky, which is probably Cloud City. Makes total fucking sense. What's the battle of Vogental? The final battle between humans and mobs. The end of our entire age. Hmm. Sounds promising. I want to. Did you say you lost your sight? Yes, that happens when you blind yourself. Oh. If the dead eye god has no need for sight, then neither do we. Huh. Wait a minute, then how could you tell I was coming closer? Hey, can I get you guys something? Like what? This day. I don't know, Driftwood. I don't know. Some more holy tear gas? Oh yeah, here. That works. <laughs> Just fill that up for me if you could. Thanks. Oh. Uh. Can I go inside? You wish to invade our holiest of shrines? Why? Ugh. I don't, really, if I'm being completely honest. Then be gone. Alright, I guess I gotta go find something for you guys to use. I don't know. Wait. Is that fish? What is that? I think those little slippers they had on. Just uh, my size. Oh yeah, those. Right, I forgot. <laughs> So, let's go explore some more. What time is it? 11.13. Alright, we got about 30 more minutes, I think. Alright. Wait, These why am I... These holes are useless. All the hooks have been stolen. I can't fill the holy tear gas dispenser with that. Yeah, you can. You just choose Is not to. Is this your secret stink for attracting Mom Chakra? Uh, it's my grandmother's traditional cocktail of musk, pheromones, and animal sweat. And I'm not sharing it with anybody. Well, I don't need it anyway. Daddy says I exude it naturally. That's nasty. So... Can I... I can't fill the holy tear gas dispenser with that. Huh. I don't know where to go. <laughs> Oh wait, sap, right? I remember the thing. Let's go collect some sap. <laughs> Sorry, ass buzz. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna collect your driftwood or Hey, can I fill my spray can up with your sap? Okay, first off, I'm not here to help humans. Secondly, no, you can't have my precious lifeblood sap. Thirdly, it's too thick and rich, it would clog up your little spray can anyway. Oh. Thank you. Found some driftwood down by the beach. That's more wood. But at least it's natural and hasn't been perverted by the humans. So... Look, he also makes nice things that aren't wood. Crystals have feelings too. What the? Uh, thank you. Yeah. Have you ever seen cloud shoes? They're bent twigs, wrapped in feathers. Well, the twigs might have fallen off naturally, so that's not going to make me sick. But I can't speak for the birds. Really? We just plucked them off them, and they're not killing anybody, so... <sighs> oh my god! I might as well go see what that snake was up to. Okay, I can run, which is awesome. I don't want to get too too close. Uh, there's a sign, but I can't oh, read. Driftwood, so smooth. I might as well get okay, caught. This time, I'm sure I went the right way. Hey, cold. In case a snake blow a horn, you're welcome, Curtis. Alright, 
so the snake has nothing okay, for me. So do not go that way. Got it. Alright, let's see. What we need to do is find something to fill up my thingamajig. Oh yeah, I can give him wood. <laughs> Check it out. No, I'm talking wood. Oh, and it's so smooth. Oh man. I feel a stool coming on. What? Hmm? Oh, uh. Whew, that's a relief. Oh, that was quick. Help me. I feel ten times better. Thanks for helping me get that out of my system. I want you to have it. Really? Thanks. No problem. I like to spread my samples around. Alright. So now I got a stool. You know, Curtis looks like such a slacker, but he sure can bust out a solid stool. Hi. Hey, Bella. That sounds. Do you know what rises from a rotten bed? No. But it sounds like one of those fruity riddles my ex girlfriend Becky was into. Man, I do not miss her. <laughs> about this art. Hey, about this art. Yeah. I like how it matches your decor. Decor? I don't have a decor. The I didn't mean to say that. Decor, man. Why do you have it up then? I only had it there ironically. But I was actually getting sick of it. If you like it, just take it. Really? Be careful of the okay. chargers. Beware the trees. Alright, so I'll take it. Okay, I'm taking this. Cool. I like that kind of stuff when I was your age, too. What is it? What is it supposed to be? A little man with a bad haircut? <laughs> I guess at first glance one might see it that way. Hmm. I guess I can go back up to the sky if I wanted to. And I also have this. Hey, the sun part, um, fell out when I walked by. Man, I guess the heavy crystal I used for the sun needs a thicker lead around it. Just put it back up there and I'll fix it later. No, I'm gonna steal it. <laughs> yeah. I think we're good. We'll talk to you later. Um... Anything else? Okay. Let's go. You see he has a ladder going straight out of his roof? Yeah, because that's a ladder that fell down, remember? Oh, yeah. Sorry to do this to you, but... Oh, my God. Is that... mutilated tree flasks? You see, what Curtis does is he peels off the outer layer of the wood...